Take a look at this little baby rat snake. Notice how his neck is has an odd crook in it. That's because he is deformed. Now he's not alive because his egg was in the process of hatching and he died while trying to break out of his egg. He actually was able to make little slices in his egg with his egg tooth, but then he stopped hatching. And I went on ahead and opened the egg up and found that he has a bad deformity. And obviously it killed him. So instead of wasting this poor little snake, you know, just burying him out in the woods, which isn't really a waste, by the way, it's, it's part of the circle and cycle of life, but I'm gonna feed him to a king snake. Some of you might think that is disgusting and gross, but it's natural, so here we go. King snake. And here we go. He struck it. Oh, he knows what it is now. There he goes. Oh, look, just like spaghetti. Now, of course, king snakes are reptile predators. That is what they like to eat the most, is other snakes. So he is enjoying his meal right now, as you can see. Almost finished with it. <laughs> that little bit of slime on the rat snake is a little bit of his egg yolk left over from being inside the egg. Now you can see him as he makes those S's with his body. That's how a snake swallows. He makes the S, the little wave with his body, the S shape, and that pushes his meal back into his stomach. He's almost finished. Boy, what a fast meal. Look at that. A little bit of the tail still sticking out of his mouth. And it's gone. Uh, 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 uh. There's no more. Uh, there's no. There's no more. He's a, he's a very aggressive feeder, so I'm gonna have to close it off. But there you go. Okay, so right over here in this little blue tub are the babies that survived. I would imagine like everything else, somebody else had a pet, couldn't take care of it. Oh, whoa! Little baby snakes everywhere. Little baby snakes everywhere. Look at them all. Look at that little guy. Just sitting there hanging out on the edge of the tub. And these guys are only about, well, right about a week old now. They've been hatching over the last week. And here's an egg that's in the process of hatching. I made a hole in the egg earlier because the little baby had made some slices with his egg tooth, but he was not able to get out and so I just ripped a bigger hole so he'll come out on his own time. I'm not exactly sure who the, the parents are. I do believe Scar is the father but I don't know who the mother is. And some of them have some interesting colors like brighter colors. Their grays are very bright so it could be that the albinistic rat snake that we have might have been the mother. So these little baby snakes, they are going to stay here with us for a while and grow, and then I will find them homes, find them really good homes. I'll probably end up keeping one of them. I'll probably end up keeping this one. He has a very unique pattern and color. If you can see, those dark blotches on his back have little pale centers. He's just a really pretty snake. I mean, they're all beautiful, but that one, I don't know. He's something else.
And we hatched all these guys out right here in the nature center, in this little tub. Shack like a train on the track 